In 2012, John Tapper was called in to rescue Extreme Sports Bar and Grill, a bikini bar teetering on the brink of failure. We were in debt $180,000. The bar was dilapidated. We had a lot of issues. Terry drinking all the time. Uh, we're doing this. Cheers. John immediately took charge and addressed the major issues between owner Terry and manager Gary. We have a great GM, we empower him, and we have systems. I started trusting him more, and things were outstanding. By implementing new food, drinks, as well as uniforms for the bartenders. The uniforms that John gave us, we liked. They were cute and complimenting. Turning the once failing extreme into second base. And as a result, sales skyrocketed. However, at the height of their success, second base was thrown a curveball and began losing $4,000 a month. Powerhouse sports bars moved within a mile. Obviously, they must have listened to John, too. Business took off for them and declined for us. As sales dwindled, Terry and Gary began blaming each other for the shrinking customer base. I mean, what can we do? Put some money in your bar. So focused on paying off his debt, Terry failed to reinvest any money back into the bar. Once again, the bar began to fall apart. With business declining, I was not able to maintain the keg raiders, buying product, plumbing started going bad. You gotta do something about this bathroom. Terry just said, there's no money, there's no customers. Go back to the bikinis. That's what I made my businesses off of. With the clock winding down and having been rescued by John once already, Second base is in need of a pinch hitter. If the bar just shut down, we'll probably have to file bankruptcy. Faced with the embarrassment of a re-rescue and the possibility of closing second base for good, Terry has agreed to pull back the doors, bust open the books, and make a call for help to Bar Rescue. Again.